13 reads stop the summer slide sponsored by independent bank Although most kids are heading back to school this week, our 13 Reads Literacy Campaign to stop that summer slide continues through the Labor Day weekend. Ask any parent of a struggling or reluctant reader and they will likely tell you they have tried just about everything. 13 On Your Side's Katherine Barrett joins us now with the news of an unexpected resource that involves no reading at all. Okay, parents, as you load up the car for one last long summer weekend, we're talking Labor Day weekend, you might want to consider packing a few audiobooks because research shows they may actually help children become better readers. Now, I used to think it was cheating, but according to the reading website Brightly, most educators agree audiobooks count as real reading. The website says when a child listens to a story, just like reading one, it requires them to use reading comprehension skills. They make connections, visualize what they're hearing, make predictions, ask questions all the things they do when reading a book. But experts say audiobooks are portable and it's easier to fit them into a busy routine. For kids, it helps build that automaticity. Um, again, they get to hear um, what words are supposed to sound like. And it also tends to expand their vocabulary because oftentimes you're gonna be learning new words that you didn't know before. Well, most local libraries have fairly large collections of audiobooks, so it's worth giving them a try. And with back to school schedules getting busy for many families, parents who struggle to fit in reading time for the kids or who hate the fight to encourage a reluctant reader, well, audiobooks could be the answer, at least in part. And they are free to check out at your local library, so you certainly can't beat that. Charlie, Juliet. 